boom and we're recording hello world what's up guys welcome back to today's video i need a little bit of britney spears midnight fantasy to calm me down you guys my champagne problems today are literally out of control first of all let's start with the positive i'm actually going to see aladdin later today and i am so excited i was a kid when that whole like cinderella aladdin lion king that whole generation of original disney movies came out and since they've been remaking them i am here for every single one of them so because i'm going out later today i need to tone my hair my hair you guys is looking like a yellow snow cone so i'm gonna dive right into that and i've got a lot to tell you guys i haven't filmed in almost two weeks I feel like I'm coming up on actually two and a half weeks. Literally the longest that I haven't filmed since I started my channel. I've got so much to tell you guys. You know, the worst of the worst happened to me and I lost a bunch of files and I'll tell you guys all about that. But I need to get this toner on my head and we are just going to hang out today, chit chat. It's going to be a totally low key video and we're just going to hang out. Pretend that I called you on the telephone. I've got a lot to tell you. All right, let's just dive right into toning my hair because I can't stand this yellow hair any longer. Now, you guys, today's video, also, I'll have all these products linked in the description box down below. So if you're preparing your blonde hair for summer and you want to tone your hair and tone along with me, I'll have all these products linked down below. So anyway, guys, today I was supposed to, well, literally every day for the last two weeks, I have been waiting for my Kylie Skin skincare set. Y'all, I bought that set within the first six minutes before it sold out, and it still is not in my possession. I have seen so many people review the collection, and I was so excited to give it a try. Literally, though, after two weeks of waiting, I'm almost over it. I'm still, you know, really excited to try the skincare set, but hello, it is 2019. Why is it taking two full weeks? I mean, listen, the restock for the Kylie skin set is literally tomorrow, and... I don't even have my original set. I feel like that's not even fair. I feel like that's just cruel. Why is Kylie doing me dirty like this? Why is it taking so long? I mean, even Sephora ships their products out within like, I feel like it's, and I don't even get one day shipping, but I feel like it's one day or two days and the product literally arrives at the door. Two weeks is just insane. Now, I feel like I've seen so many reviews from so many different people I feel like I'm starting to get like a preconceived notion before the product arrived and I wanted to be one of the first people to review the Kylie Skin skincare system. Hello, I know you guys are just like, Trevor, when are you reviewing the Kylie Skin skincare set? Because I shared with you on my Instagram story that I bought it and everyone is waiting and they're like, Trevor, how do you like it? And I'm like, sorry, don't know. I just realized there's a hole in my glove, but we're not going to worry about it because toner is not too scary. Like, Kylie, how much longer am I going to have to wait for my skincare set? I mean, I'm not very excited to try the Walnut Face Scrub, you guys know. That's pretty much the one that's got the most flack on the internet. And I'm thinking I'll almost use it on my Keratosis Polaris on those bumps on the back of my arm. It's kind of an expensive exfoliator for the arms, but, you know, we'll see how it goes. I just got some toner on my shirt, but don't worry. This is totally just like a sleeping shirt, hangout shirt, Instagram baddies, Instagram baddies. Oh my god, I mean Disney baddies. Which Disney baddie are you? Which one would you be? A lot of times I feel like Ursula, but then other times I kind of feel like the Snow White Queen. Let me know in the comments down below. Which Disney baddie are you? All right, now I need to stress, you guys, I am not a hairdresser. So take your hair into your own hands or trust a professional. I've been dyeing my hair blonde for a really long time. Actually, when I started my YouTube channel, for the majority of it, my hair was actually blonde. And then I decided brown hair was just kind of like, you know, easier to maintain. My scalp was so dry. As you'll see, here we go. Because I apply the toner and the bleach to my entire head, you know, if you go to a hairdresser, they try and avoid your scalp. That's not very easy to do at home. So unfortunately the product gets on my scalp, it gets a little bit dry. So it's just hard to maintain. So I just wanted to give my hair a little bit of a break. And I haven't been blonde for a really long time. But then when Cousin Megan came, I was like, you know what? I just want to dye my hair blonde. It's been so long. I always say that I like my hair color better brown, but I like my life better blonde. Honestly, it's true. Blondes do have more fun. Just about something being blonde that I love. Although with my fair skin tone, my new fair skin tone, it can be a little bit jarring. Like sometimes I feel like I look a little bit anemic. Don't worry, I'm not anemic. I was actually tested for anemia once because you guys, I don't know if this ever happened to you, but I literally one time 
had these fainting spells and they were sure that I was like diabetic or something. Turns out literally nothing was wrong with me. But making sure that I wasn't anemic was part of that process. So literally I'm not anemic. I'm just fair skinned with blonde hair. What am I even talking about? Now this is a look. I feel like I look like Beetlejuice. I feel like I didn't make enough toner to cover my whole head, but you don't have to be too scared of toning your hair at home. Literally, nothing too bad can go wrong with it. Knock on wood. And I actually... And I actually bought the wrong toner. I bought a shade lighter than I normally do. I like my hair to be more of kind of like a gray or a platinum blonde, but I bought the Wella T14 toner instead of the T18 toner. So it's not gonna go quite as dark, not quite as purple as the T18, but that's about it. I'm just gonna leave this on my hair. <gasps> Amazing, there we go. Literally, it's that easy to tone your hair at home. If you're a blonde or someone who has like platinum hair, or even if you have gray hair, just wanna get that platinum finish, toning your hair at home, it's not that hard. I've actually done a more in-depth video, which I'll have linked down below. It's a great way for you guys to learn. I think the first part was how to bleach your hair at home. And then the second part is how to tone your hair at home. Now, normally I'm not gonna do it today because it's literally so embarrassing, but I use these little shower caps, these little disposable shower caps. I'm not even gonna put it on my head because you guys are going to make fun of me. I look like a 65 year old woman, which no shade. I'm literally a 65 year old woman trapped inside a young man's body. I can totally relate. So when I'm at home chilling, I just throw that on my hair. That way I don't get product anywhere. But for the sake of today's video, I'm not gonna apply it. I'm gonna spare myself the shame. All right. I also wanted to tell you guys, I brought this out. I have been loving, literally speaking of being a 65 year old woman, the Gold Bond Eczema Cream. I've literally been obsessed with this. It's 2% colloidal oatmeal eczema relief. Skin protectant helps relieve five symptoms of eczema, itchy, dryness, rashes, roughness, and irritation. Now I get really dry between my fingers and I was like, I need to try something, something other than just like a generic hand cream. And I've been loving the Gold Bond for your entire body. The reason that I ended up with the Gold Bond creams is because I am an extreme couponer. You guys, I live in Canada, so I can't get too extreme, but I love coupons, I love digital deals, I love to combine them together with a sale, and I love to get products super cheap. And I actually got the Gold Bond for your entire body with a coupon and a digital coupon. I think I paid like $2 for it. Such a great deal. And because I love the body lotion so much, I decided to pick up the hand cream, and it was no exception. I'm obsessed. Saving money and getting new products. You guys, two of my favorite things. Something else I've been loving that I wanted to tell you guys about is the Shiny Silver Ultra Color Enhancing Purple Conditioner. I got this at Sally's Beauty Supply. Now, when I was blonde in the old days, I used to use a purple conditioner every couple of days in the shower. Now I use it in a totally different way, a totally different way that I actually made up. I didn't see this tip anywhere. I just tried it one day and it worked like magic is I mix a little bit of this in with my hair product. So whether I'm using a paste, even a gel, um, a mousse, it turns the hair product purple and it almost covers up that yellow or that brassiness instantly. When I wash it out at the end of the day, none of that color deposits and my hair isn't purple, but the purple color in the conditioner honestly masks that yellow right away and takes the edge off for when I really need my hair to be kind of extra platinum, like if I'm going out somewhere or I just want to look kind of like my best, my sleekest. And every time I've done this, I've got compliments on the color of my hair. So if you're someone with platinum hair, try mixing this together with your actual hair product. Let me know in the comments down below how it works for you. All right, now while we wait for this toner to set in my hair, let's go ahead and apply a little bit of skincare. And I need to let you guys know what is going on with my channel and what to expect in the next couple of weeks because you guys have probably been wondering like, Trevor, where are you? Other than the videos that I had posted with cousin Megan over the last couple of weeks, you guys have probably noticed that I haven't been posting as consistently. Now, honestly, I took just a week off for vacation, just kind of like a week for me before summer kicked off because trust me, I have plans of going full tilt this summer. So if you're someone who goes to school and you're on summer vacation, get ready to hang out with me all summer. So I took a week off and then cousin Megan came. So I kind of took another week off, but not really because we did film a couple of videos while she was here. So I didn't really take any time off, but I just needed some time to, when you're a creator, you need to think about videos, obviously shoot the videos, collect the products, do post production, edit them, upload them, you know, the whole nine yards, thumbnail promotion, all that stuff. It's a lot of work, not complaining. I absolutely love it but I just wanted to take a little break. 
And then you guys, something so demonstrous, something so quaking, shaking happened to me. Not only did I lose a bunch of videos that I had filmed for you guys, but my phone actually crashed and I lost everything. I lost all my pictures, all my videos. My phone was backed up to a computer, but the backup was corrupt because I ended up backing it up while the phone was basically melting down. My iPhone just decided one day the firm or the hardware inside the phone just decided to stop working and shutting on and off and on and off and on and off. And the people at the Genius Bar did the best that they could, but unfortunately, I can't believe, ugh, literally, I can't even say this out loud. I lost everything. So I lost when Britney Spears waved at me. I lost um, seeing CL from 21. I lost all my Vegas trips. I lost Beyonce clips. I lost Lady Gaga concerts. I literally lost everything. And amongst losing all of those memories, I also lost some videos that I shot for you guys. So not only I say all of this to tell you that I ended up taking a week off, then Cousin Megan came, I took a week off, and then I lost all my videos that I had pre-filmed for you guys. So you will notice over like the next two weeks, I'm going to end up publishing a bunch of pre-recorded videos. They're probably not going to make sense to you because my hair is going to go from brown to blonde to brown to blonde. I even had an entire Retin A week all filmed, all my ideas were ready in the can, it was ready to roll when I lost a bunch of footage. So even during my Retin A week, which I still plan on doing, you're going to see my hair go from blonde to brown to blonde to brown, and you're going to be like, Trevor, what the heck is going on? If you see anyone in the comments down below being like, Trevor, what's happening to your hair? Please redirect them to this video. Speaking of, you guys literally are lighting up the comments. I love it. I love seeing the same names. I love meeting you guys. And we're approaching 10,000 subscribers literally faster than ever. So if you've been following me since the very beginning, leave me a comment in this video down below. Just say, hey, hi, what's up? Because I feel like after 10,000, it's gonna be tough to keep up with people in the comments and get to meet you guys, get to know you. So I would love to get to know you now, kind of before things, you know, blow up. I'm just gonna make myself another coffee, give this like maybe 10 more minutes on my head. I'm gonna rinse it out. I'll meet you guys right back here. I'll update you. Then I've gotta get going because Aladdin literally, oh my God, I need to go. Woo. All right, as you guys can see, toning my hair just kind of got rid of that yellowness, that brassiness. I have much more of like a silver or almost like a gray finish now. Literally, yellow hair is my arch nemesis. Anyway, guys, I have got to get going because I am going to see the matinee of Aladdin and I don't want to be late because I want a little bit of popcorn. If you've seen Aladdin, let me know in the comments down below. Are you from that original Aladdin generation like I am? And have you seen it again? I hope that it's literally like identical, just upgraded in 2019. I wish that today's video could have been a review of the Kylie Jenner skincare set. Unfortunately, that review won't be coming today. Hopefully, it will be the next video that you see after this one. Hopefully, it arrives any day, any minute. I'm ready. I've got all my notes ready to go. They are right over there, pinned up on my corkboard. I can't wait to do that review for you guys and dive into the entire Kylie skincare set. And because it's June, if you're graduating, congratulations. If you're going on summer vacation, get ready to relax and enjoy. Whew, there is a cat hair. I've got to get out of here, guys. If you enjoyed today's video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Hit subscribe right down below to join this ever-growing family share this video it really helps me out and if you made it to the very end this is a special thank you a special thank you to you for sticking around until the very end i am out of here i'll see you in the next video bye guys